All right, guys, welcome back to Let's Get Digital. Let's go take our tour of Cinnabar Island. To our right, you'll see this lovely gym, but the door is locked. There's a message written in small letters on the door. Quiz time, where there's a key, where's the key that let you into this gym? Hint, the answer can be found somewhere in a building that is overgrown with greenery. I wonder what that could mean. Cinnabar Island, the fiery town of burning desire. Could it be this building that is overrun with greenery? That is the old Pokemon mansion where Mewtwo was created? Scientists sometimes go into the Pokemon mansion to carry out different experiments. Yeah, I don't know why this is the place to do it, but that's cool. I mean, whatever. Found an antidote. The antidote. So that's where we're going to get our key. Oh, what's this? Cinnabar Lab. Okay, let's go take a look at Cinnabar Lab. Give me all your Pokemon! We study Pokemon here day in and day out. People even bring us rare Pokemon to examine. Who is this guy? Photo of Cinnabar Lab's founder, Dr. Fuji. But he's not in Cinnabar. He's in Lavender Town. Ignoring Team Rocket. Did you come to have a look at our lab? Most impressive. I like to see that kind of drive. Yeah, sure. I did. I did. What do we got going on over her? This sofa is very soft and comfortable. Okay. Uh, Creeper, again. I'm 10 years old. Stay away. My Growlithe will burn you to death. This is a reception room. It's a room where we talk with our guests. When we don't have guests, this is a place to jerk off. I mean, slack off. I mean, what? I found this most remarkable fossil inside of Mount Moon. I think it's of a rare Pokemon. Pokemon. Gotta broke them. Uh oh. What is he doing just staring at some freaking plant? Hey! No running in the hallways, boy. I've always wanted a chance to say something like that. I know he goes, boy, I've always wanted to say something like that. But I like the way that I said it better. Oh my goodness, there's so many bros to talk to. Science bros. Ooh, what have I done? I accidentally wrote on the board with permanent marker. Maybe I could turn it the other way and no one would ever know. Well, step one, don't tell people. And then step two, then cover up your tracks. You tell people, I'm going to tell this dude, if I had an option, I'd be like, look, that dude just wrote all sorts of just like derogatory terms all over that marker. <laughs> that whiteboard with that marker. Permanent marker. Goodness. That's right. Eevee has the potential to evolve into a variety of different ways. Yeah, like freaking 30, but not all the types. You have to keep waiting generations. Oh. Come at me. <laughs> I'm a scientist that's been working without sleep or rest. Do you really think you stand a chance? Oh, that's amazing. Sorry to taunt you like that all suddenly. I haven't slept in days. Here, I'll give you this. Don't you think you could forgive me? Taunt. Dude, being a gamer, I know how he feels. You put TMO2 in the case. That move's taunt. It forces your opponent to only use moves that cause damage. Yeah, I can't be using Calm Mind for 10 years. <laughs> I'm so busy. Never a moment to breathe. Certainly no time to be talking to children. Alright, get out of here, guy. I'm just trying to be cool give you a reprieve from your depressing job. Don't you think this machine looks rather like a washing machine? It's not, though. Okay. Cool story, bro. This is where we get Aerodactyl. Spoiler alert. My eyes get so tired when I look at a computer for too long. Resting your eyes is really important, you know. Yeah, and my monitor, since I got a new monitor, is always like super close up to me, so you want to have it further back. You can put on these those super gamer glasses that I have. Maybe when I become a fossil, they'll revive me in the distant future. Maybe. That'd be cool if they revive you like with your consciousness intact. I think about that more than I should. Hiya! I am an important doctor. Yes, very well known indeed. Here. I study rare Pokemon fossils. Hey, do you have a fossil for me? Sure. Oh, it's a dome fossil it is. It is a fossil of Kabuto, a Pokemon that is already extinct. Shall I use my resurrection machine to make that Pokemon live again? Yes. So, give it here. You hand it over the dome fossil to the doctor. Oh, I had it reversed. You get Aerodactyl from the people in like, uh... What's that town that has the Brock's gym? Pewter City. You get, I think you get Aerodactyl from Pewter City. You bring it to this dude, then he'll revive it. Success! The fossil was a Kabuto, as I thought. You have Kabuto from the doctor! Sick. I like Kabuto, and I like Ammonite, too. 
Oh, too bad he's not shiny. That would have been so cool if he was shiny. Pokemon that was recovered from a fossil. It used to be, it used the eyes on its back while hiding on the seafloor. You tuck Kabuto away in the Pokemon boxing bag. I thought his eyes were on the bottom. I don't know. So either way, the eyes on the bottom are fake. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I like Kabuto a lot. Well then, come back soon. All the matter, <laughs> all matter is made up of tiny molecules. Like It's like how a hundred Poke Dollars is a collection of lots of one Poke Dollars. Well, that's a good way to put it. That is a good way to put it. Okay, let's finish out this tour. He's running, running, run, running, running. What does this guy say again? Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Should talk to check out what little magazines they have too. Not that I actually care. Oh, she's got a magmar. Cinnabar Islands Blaine. Oh, Gems Blaine is an odd one. He's lived on the island since way before the Pokemon Lab was built. And here is the Pokemon Center. I came in and healed my Pokemon before. I came to visit Cinnabar Island Gym, but the door is locked tight. There must be a key somewhere, though. Maybe that old mansion? They say that one of the gym leader's friends used to live there. Mewtwo? Was that his friend? Do you have lots of friends? It was a Pokemon you get by training with friends grow faster. I think it'd be worth giving you time training to try. <laughs> get some words out. Pokemon can keep learning new moves even if you stop them from evolving. It's a trick that experienced trainers know. Wait till your Pokemon learns a move it wouldn't otherwise, then evolve it. He wanted to say it in some dumb BS way, but I said it the way I want to say it. Are you interested in dark type Pokemon? If you have a Grimer, maybe I could trim my dark type Grimer for it? Uh, no. <laughs> Suit yourself. Get here, just face the wall, bro. You're in timeout. No one said that you could come out yet. And let's check out the Pokemart. Then we'll do the mansion, then we'll do the gym, then we'll do the whatever, and the whatever, and the yeah. Never hurts to have extra items, you never know what might happen. Yeah. You get mugged. Wonder if I can pick up any X attacks here. I like X attacks because you can boost your Pokemon's attack stat with them. And, I don't know, maybe you should ask the guy who sells you the items. But I guess that's not up to me. Alright guys, I think that's it for Cinnabar Island Tour. It's just this tiny little thing, but we got a Kabuto out of it. Let's go ahead and spend more time and put him in my party. Maybe he'll be my water. I'll have a water rock instead of a water flying. How about them apples? Now nah, we'll wait till next time. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys for our next little episode of exploring the Pokemon Mansion for the Super Key. All right, guys. Thanks for watching, and I will catch you again next time.